kind of videos to film because it involves food <laughs> I've never ever seen this before but I'm actually so keen and this is on sale it's like $3 I'm like oh that's so cheap and guys it's high in protein for like a plant based plant based? yeah plant based meat substitute like what? it literally is 18 grams of plant protein in one serving like I don't get how there's 18 grams of protein in this and I'm so excited to try it because it actually looks pretty good I'll try this tomorrow for you guys I can give you guys like a proper review on it I'm so excited got some more pasta protein I've got two packets because I can go through this like real quick <laughs> I don't know if they have it anywhere else but in Australia up and go was such a big thing when I was growing up and I got myself some up and go because they, they finally have a dairy free option it's like mm, yes please i'm gonna put it <gasps> guys i already have a plan up and go with my wheat fix that's gonna be my snack and i'm so excited <gasps> with some blueberries oh and some maple syrup <sniffs> guys mm, staples you know, they have up and go high protein ones, but they are they're dairy in them, so I didn't get them for myself. I got them for my brother. They have 17 grams of protein in one drink. Sometimes you can't even get 17 grams of protein in a meal. So if you can get it in a drink, winning. Some passata for my pasta. I've got some oat milk. Um, we're trying different brands because we have a coffee machine at home, like the ones that froth the milk in like a proper coffee machine. And we've been like playing around with different kinds of oat milks. So we'll see. Hopefully these ones are good and we want like a creamy consistency that replicates a full cream milk. I'm excited. Anyways, I kind of want to try it up and go. Do a little bit of a taste test. I actually will. If this is good. <laughs> You best bet I'm going to get more. Let's try it. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I don't know why I'm smug. <laughs> say hi! <laughs> Hello! Hello! Oh, you want to say hi as well? Hi! Dairy free, my dear. Hey! <laughs> but sugar are cool. No, it's not. Oh, it is. It's got 11 grams of sugar in it. <gasps> yeah, that's pretty high. I'm not gonna lie. For this tiny ass thing, 11 grams of sugar. Okay, that's a lot. I'm not gonna lie. I'm trying to like stay away from sugar a little bit. Like cut back on sugar because I feel like the more I have sugar, the more I get triggered and want to eat more sugar. It's literally an addiction that I want to like slowly cut down on. So. I didn't realize. Oh crap. Okay, that's right. This is just gonna be a nice little sweet treat. You know what I'm saying? That's right. It's fine. It's fine. I'm sorry. <laughs> just having a snack. Um. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, we're not insecure. We're freaking beautiful. We're gorgeous. Enough said. Anyways. <laughs> <clears throat> Good morning, guys. Hi. This is what I'm having for breakfast. <laughs> yeah, this is my breakfast before the gym. The Sour Patch Kids. Because I'm literally craving so bad. Can't help but. Guys, I'm sorry, but watermelon is the best flavor out there. You can't tell me otherwise. <laughs> Sour Patch is so good, but it's so bad for your teeth. Like, I can feel my teeth just dying right now because of how chewy it is. It's currently 8 o'clock right now. I wanted to go a bit earlier today, like I was meant to go at like 7.30, but 
kind of slept in a little bit <laughs> couldn't sleep last night you know i had problems sleeping so i'm like i let myself sleep in today and now we're at the gym and we're gonna smash it out do some legs and um show you guys my workout i guess all right so <laughs> anyways let's go let's go to the gym <laughs> The sausage, I'm going to try like I promised. Here goes nothing. It literally looks like a proper sausage, doesn't it? Like, it looks legit. Now, I'll try it with that sauce first. Okay. Mmm. Chili feels like a proper sausage. I feel like they replicated it really well. God damn. It tastes even better with. Oh. I'm just having an egg omelette and some apples as well. I would say it's a solid 8 out of 10. I'm not gonna lie. Literally, I just chucked the sausage in the air fryer. I didn't need to cook it on a pan or anything, and literally, it was so easy. I just chucked it in. I cooked it for like 10 minutes, and there she is. She's done. And ready to be eaten. I love air fryers, like honestly. I cannot live without it. I feel like it's an essential in every household. Just saying. If you don't have one, invest in one. Waking up feeling like it's gonna rain. It's sunny up, but it just comes in waves. Good morning, happy Wednesday. Mm. I don't know why I did that. I can't talk if I have my mouth full. <laughs> but that tasted off. Ooh. Holy. Wow. I'm not sure what happened to that apple. That was nasty. Anyways, oh, the, what a waste of an apple. Ah! I don't like wasting food, but I. That tasted so off, I couldn't, I can't do it. I'm not really hungry, what time is it? It's kind of like almost 12 o'clock actually. It is 12 o'clock, so it's not the morning anymore. <laughs> it is the afternoon. <laughs> Whoops, oh, it's kind of, oops, but yeah, it's the afternoon now. It's actually 12 o'clock, 12.02 to be exact. Um, I did just come back from the gym, except I couldn't finish my session at the gym because I um, kind of injured my pinky. I kind of accidentally smashed the way down onto my pinky and then it peeled my skin off and it started bleeding. So I was like, let's get out of here ASAP and peace out. <laughs> oh, the sun's out. Maybe I can go for a walk now. I, I just need some like fresh air. <sighs> you know, I just need some fresh air right now. <laughs> it was so exciting. I'm just looking on my phone. Like, I don't know why I'm covering my face, but I have a six month transformation and so I'm excited but I'm also very nervous to you know because it's gonna be pretty intense I'm not gonna lie it is something I have committed myself to in terms of challenging myself um, and building more muscle and strength and then, you know, obviously seeing some physique transformation at the end of the six month period. I've never tried anything like this before. So I will be updating you guys on, you know, like what the haps and, you know, you'll see the struggles of how I am going to tackle this 12 week program. Ah, I'm going to be tracking my calories and macros and you know sticking to it as much as i can to obviously get better results in terms of like you know muscle growth and all that stuff starting from june it's going to be a 12 week strength training 
program and then from september to november that is going to be the 12 week body recomposition phase oh my god this is the fat loss phase guys and that's gonna be intense because that's obviously meaning i'll be in a calorie deficit that means i actually have to you know be disciplined that this is where the discipline comes in which i kind of lack i've been kind of gaining a bit of weight which i've been okay with because you know it comes with my eating habits and you know in order to gain muscle you do need to be in a surplus anyways as long as like i don't go overboard with consuming foods then it's it's fine it's fine it's it's okay to get fluffy no matter what phase you are in your life i like to call it fluffy because like i don't know i find it cuter to say fluffy than you know chunky i used to say chunky but now i like to say fluffy i'm getting fluffier and that's okay that means i'm gonna be growing some muscles honestly i accept it like you don't have to love it just accept the fact that you're gonna you know gain some extra fluff when you're eating more food and what not and hypertroph hypertroph a girl can't read hypertroph hypertroph of oh, muscle building <laughs> How do you say it? Let me Google it. How do you say it? Hypertrophy. 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 Why can't I say it? Hypertrophy. 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 I sound like an idiot. <laughs> oh my god. Hypertrophy. 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 Hypertrop. Guys, whatever it is, I'm <laughs> just not gonna say it. <laughs> it is um, that. I saw. Fu fu oh, now I can't talk at all. So yeah, that's that's the go with the next six months <laughs> of my life. <laughs> I'm kind of excited and also very nervous, guys. I'm so nervous. <laughs> it really means I have to be disciplined. Gotta get my head in the game to get the gains. I'm gonna take you guys with me, obviously, through this journey. Experience it with me. Yeah, it's gonna be great. That's all for the update, I guess. Yeah. Ta da! Sprained it. Yay! Okay, I shouldn't have done that. This is my life, starting from today. I don't know how long for, but... <sighs> We're gonna be disabled for a bit. Guys, we'll catch up on what happened in the last day. Yesterday I was fine. Peachy even. I was playing netball yesterday, within the last three minutes of the last quarter I just KO'd onto the floor because I landed on someone's foot when I was jumping and then I rolled my ankle on the right side. Ha! I sprained it. That's what I did. And now I have this as like my best friend. Some crutches. I love that for me. Love it. I oh, love it. Absolutely love it. So I can't work out, can't walk, sitting down, or lying down all day. I need to move. Like even if it's around the house, just to walk around. I can't just sit still, I really can't. It's not my thing. What can you do? Because it actually hurts to walk with crutches. It hurts my armpits and like I'm putting a lot of pressure on my arms to hold myself up. If you have had crutches before, you would know. So, yeah, that's my life. Life's good. My parents were not happy with me. Like, at all. My dad literally, this morning, he's like, this is why. I'm like, <laughs> I knew exactly what he was talking about. He's like, this is why. I'm like, what? <laughs> I just pretended to play down. I'm like, what? What do you mean? He's like, this is why I don't like you guys playing netball. Me and my sister play netball. I'm just like, what do you mean? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> 
Just because this happened doesn't mean nothing, okay? I've been playing for years and I've only ever gotten injured, I think, once. And it was pretty bad, to be honest. I had to get surgery on my knee. It was a, an ACL. Like, I tore my ACL. I had to get a surgery. But this time, it's just a mild sprain. I'm assuming. I haven't gone to the doctors. I don't really want to. I don't feel like it's that bad. Mm, another update. The cases in Melbourne are going up right now. COVID cases. Right now, I think we have 29 COVID cases. Local transmission. And... I have a feeling we're going to be going into lockdown very soon. So, it's going to be interesting. Everyone's going to be home. It's going to be fun. Not really. My favorite drink of all time. Anything kombucha. It's got probiotics. It's good for you. And it's sweet. What more could you ask for? The fact that it's good for you. And... You know, it's like a healthier alternative to soft drinks. I've never really been into soft drinks, I'm not going to lie. Like, I don't crave that stuff. You guys can watch me apply this deep heat onto my ankle. My lovely swollen ankle. Which is a bit swollen. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's actually really bad. I haven't really looked at it. I just put socks on this morning because I don't want to look at it. I just knew it was really painful. <laughs> um, oh my god, that's actually really bad. Whoa. That is swollen as heck. <gasps> wow. You guys need to see this. I don't know if you guys can tell. But. Sorry, foot content. But that's really swollen. Like that. Can you guys see that? That. Is hell so on compared to this side? Like, oh my god, that's bad. That's actually really bad. Oh my god, I didn't realize how bad that was. This is what hurts. Whoa. Oh my god. I did ice it yesterday, last night, but. Eee, that's a bit worrying. No wonder why it was really painful last night. I could not find like a proper sleeping position because it actually killed to move it around. Oh, hell no. It's a lot more serious than I thought it was. <laughs> bitch, you're doing a good job, bitch. You're doing a good job. I actually made like a... I would say it was a really funny video. I'm gonna insert it. Bitch, you doing a good job. 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 Fuck that laundry. Fuck that dish. Take a break and shake that Making shit. fun of my little incident. Because why the heck not? A little bit of news update on the whole lockdown situation. Guys, we have a lockdown in Melbourne starting from tonight, midnight, I think. I don't know the exact details, but I've been, um, my sister has been, oh, my sister has just been updating, like, our family in our group chat, and she said, there's going to be lockdown, Ooh. but I mean, honestly, I'm technically in lockdown anyways, not like I can leave my house, not with this thing going on, so, it's like, cool, we're all in this together, really, we're all going to be stuck at home. I'm going to work and that's about it round two melbourne i really hope it's not gonna be that long i really hope nothing we can do about it really mm -hmm. Hi. good morning it's currently 8 32 right now just been chilling in bed i've been wanting to get up because my stomach is kind of hungry at the moment kind of but I really can't be bothered getting up. I, I tried to get up this morning. This morning, it's still morning. You know what I mean. I tried to get up earlier and use my crutches. Oh my god. My armpits hurt. 
I'm not over exaggerating. I feel like it's bruised, like really bad. I haven't, I haven't looked at it yet. It hurts. And I think it's not from the crutches. I just realized that um, at the end of the game, I think I showed you guys a clip yesterday. I'll show it again. <laughs> but when I was getting carried out like that on both arms, I literally feel like my armpits were going to rip off. Because, like, I could not touch the ground and, like, I was just literally just, like, hanging on. I was pulling against my arms. The pressure was fully on my armpits. It literally hurts more than my ankle at this, at this point. Like, I'd rather just stay still and not use my crutches. Because this kills. I can't put any pressure in it. It actually kills. <laughs> oh. Honestly, I can't be bothered at the moment, so I'm just listening to meditation music. Hey guys. I was planning to journal while I listen to some meditation music. I might do that now. Might as well. Let me just see you guys down. I'm a journal. I haven't journaled in a while, actually. When was the last time I properly journaled? 20th. Uh, it's been a week since I've properly edited. Edited, I meant properly journaled. I've been too lazy. So it's probably still congested in here the last seven days. So it's time. Jill. Don't be lazy. I just, just do it. Just journal. It benefits you more than anyone. Okay. All right. Cool. <laughs> Reveal. Oh. <laughs> I didn't put face on. to not you know walk outside or literally just you know just do something that involves movement but what can you do right there we go i'm just gonna wash my face i put a face mask on because i feel like i need it like a little bit of a self-care moment face mask i'm low-key tired though which is a good thing i want to be able to sleep good tonight even though i didn't really do much today like physically I didn't do much but I did get some editing done just did a bit of content work today good stuff and also procrastinated a lot but what can you do? it happens I literally just feel uh, from just sitting down and then I clench my soul right now I wash my hands, don't worry they're clean, they're fresh all this hair on my fingers take that back I feel like it really detoxifies my skin I feel like I'm gonna break out you know when you feel like you're gonna break out yeah it's exactly what I'm feeling right now I can feel like a, a very big one coming right here and possibly here as well <sighs> no please go away Anyways. thank you all so much for watching and i hope you guys are all staying safe and sane wherever you are and i'll see you guys in my next video bye